We want all the Galaxy Opals in the player market. That's what we want. Because that's what we were told. We were told that was going to be the case. Weren't we told that, guys? We were told that. Now, look what we got. I mean, listen, bro, look. We're just getting diamonds and pink diamonds here as options. Like, why? When are we? You see these right here? The community is up in arms, though. I mean, if I told you half the things that were being said about this pack drop, I mean, you saw what Uncle Demi said in the opening credits, but as far as the things that are going on behind the scenes, it's a lot being said, bro. It's a lot of art. It's a lot of conversations being had right now. And these conversations are telling that uh, the community does not appreciate being lied to, first of all. And as far as things go for the next makers, some of them are some of them. Some of them aren't making noise. But as we can see, the biggest of the biggest next makers are making noise right now. They really do not appreciate what's going on in the community. These maestro packs, these iconic packs, these pack drops that we just can't get our hands on. For some reason, we just can't we can't get Opal players can't get the good opal players we can get the players that that they want us to have we can get big country brian reeves you know what i mean but we can't get a fair shake at the at the real cards in the game right now like they're locked behind a paywall and it's a stiff paywall and the fact that we don't have an auction house to supplement what's going on when we can't get the players we want it's just it's just taking a toll on us right now you know what I mean? Nothing is equal chance. They call it an equal chance, but it's not an equal chance, bro. It's just, it's just not. I mean, and this all started with Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. 100 overall Kareem is what did it. And I mean, I don't, I don't have the strength to tell you what needs to be said. I don't have the strength to say what needs to be said. But what I can say is my titles and my videos just might get a little more I might have to just step it up a notch because what's going on is we're being lied to we're being played with we're being they're playing in our face again and there's no way for me to to sugarcoat it there it's a lot of it's a whole lot of a whole lot of done data going on and this right here is the bull pucky that we have to deal with we get this this is what they give us. This is what they're handing us while they hold this in the other hand behind their back, tightly gripped and locked behind a super paywall that we just cannot get it. I mean, we just we can't break that hand and that stronghold open until they're ready to release these players and players like them. I feel like the game is just going to be in shambles. And it all started with this 100 overall Kareem. You hear those concerns loud and clear. You hear what's going on loud and clear. Now, instead of getting the Opes, instead of getting the Galaxy Opals, the Dark Matters, the 100 overalls made available for us to play with, we get Andrew Wiggins. Andrew Wiggins probably isn't that bad of a card. 93 point shot. Ah, I, that's not that hurts that. That kind of hurts. Like, no, really, what am I supposed to do with that? A 93 point shot. He has a 98 driving dunk, 95 layup. Okay, okay, I'll take that. I guess if that's what you're giving me. When we when we jumped into this agreement, we was talking about the player market. We was talking about a fair chance to, to get right, you know what I'm saying? Like we actually talked about that. That's actually what you told us was was going on. So where's the fair shake? Like me personally, I'm I'm keeping, I'm staying positive. I'm trying to stay as positive as I can. And you know, I'm thinking to myself, we'll get those those cards in the market sooner or later, later than sooner. You know what I'm saying? So I'm thinking we'll get them cards later than sooner. But um, at that point, it's gonna be too late. So I must stand up and protest. I must. Let's jump into this game though, and I'll see you when it gets in the thick of it. When we get into the thick of it. 
Now here I am following this guy. I can't even talk to this guy. I don't even know what he's. Hey yo, well y'all can't hear him, but I can. I haven't I haven't parachuted into one of these maps in so long. It's been so long, but you can see this is a beautiful game. Look at the textures. Look at the look at this ambiance, bro. I mean, it is what it is. As we parachute down in here to hopefully get this W, I just want y'all to keep one thing in mind. This is not 2K. I can be the best. When I get down here, I can find the best gun in the game. It's an option. It's an option for everyone. I can go find the care package, get the best armor in the game, get the best weapons readily available. I don't even have to go to the player market, but there is a market. I can go find a market and I can get even better weapons. Guess what? That market is available to everyone. Not just me. Nope. Everyone. Everybody. Keep that in mind. I'll see you when we get to the end. Now look at me. Here I am in less than three minutes. Three minutes into the match. Outfitted with some of the best weaponry. Some of the best gear. And a few good guys, more than anything. A few good guys with me. That are ready to get to business. We have a plan laid out. And oh, bigger than that, we have some of the best of the best energy on the planet because we can compete. Our morale is high. Yeah, we're ready. We're ready for action. As we roll into the darkness, we have one thing on our mind. Victory. Oh, it just got sticky, chat. He think he can run away? You gonna run from me? We had him in the first half. We thought he'd get away, but we got him. I don't like this gun, and that's a bot. A lot of bots around here, but it's definitely the thick of it. So we got that. Okay, we out here in it. Let's get you up, boy. Yeah, this is getting crazy. I'm going to backtrack and head courtside. Oh, Tommy Gunn. Oh, no. I couldn't hit a shot. Anyway, that's neither here nor there. Let's let's see what it takes to even get these rush. As we all know by now, Wiggins is. I mean, this is tragic, though. I mean, uh, you got you got the next makers making noise. You know it's different right now. It's the the climate is just. Eh. All right, we need 15 double doubles in a game. We need 100 blocks with centers over multiple games excluding challenges. We need six rebounds in a game with Hornet players 10 times. We need five multiplayer games, win five multiplayer games, make four, no, make 10 four pointers with Laker players over clutch time offline or online games, and then score 20 points in the paint in triple threat offline games. These look very easy. I would say they, they got, I mean, they made these very easy. 
these are easy compared to anything I've seen in these challenges. 15 double doubles over multiple games is nothing. 100 blocks is going to be probably the hardest one to get. Six rebounds in a game with Hornet players is nothing 10 times. Uh, five multiplayer wins. I mean, come on, you can get five multiplayer wins. I mean, come on. It, it might take you some time, but you're going to get them. You're going to come across five people that are going to give up that bootay, that bootata. Make 10 four pointers with Laker players over clutch time online or offline games. 10 four pointers is not going to be. I mean, with Laker players, you can go get one of them Kobe's and do that real quick. That's not going to be. I mean, come on. You got Austin Reeves. If you have Austin Reeves, it's done. 20 points in the paint and a triple threat offline game. That's going to be nothing too. You can get that in one game. They really gave us 13 days to do these Mickey Mouse. Wow. This Mickey Mouse season. So Andrew Wiggins is really not that guy. I mean, come on. How how bad to the bone is Andrew Wiggins going to be if, if that's all we got to do to get him? Come on. I mean, Wiggins on very quick. I wonder what that shot's going to be like. Honestly, another small forward shooting guard is laughable. 26 Hall of Fame badges, 35 gold ones. It's laughable. Like I said earlier in the video, this is, I don't know, this is borderline criminal. Like my last video title was 2K hates the no money spent community. And this just, this just proves it even more. I mean, yeah, he has a heavy driving dunk, but other than that, this card is more mid 98 vertical. He's a dunk master. You're going to be able to send this boy to the rim easy. I mean, he's not much of a defender. His hairline is crooked. His clothes don't fit. A 93-point shot. I mean, it's hittable, but it's just a 93-point shot. It's more mid. It's just more mid. And like I said about the badges, still no, uh, none of the, the badges that we could say would make a difference on a player. And in the animations, uh, I mean, he got Devin Booker dribble style, but that's all I really see that's standing out to me. Nothing else. Nothing else is really standing out. Yeah, so I mean, do we want to look at the other players in this in this pack drop? We can look at Dar Darren Williams. I mean, he's always been Siggy. Let's see if he's Siggy, Siggy like he should be. 19 Hall of Fames, 41 gold ones. Um, no hook specialist. No hook specialist is it for the inside game. 96 three point shot, 98 speed, 98 acceleration. 98 speed with ball, 98 ball handle, 98 pass accuracy. I mean, he's he's a ball handler, definitely. He's going to be that passer. He's going to be that that mover and shaker. No big driver, okay. No immovable enforcer, okay. I mean, I get it. But SIG-wise, Kimba Walker and Kobe Bryant on just quick. Kyrie Irving dribble style. Kimba escape. I see uh, Luka moving step back. Okay. I mean, all right. Uh, the leaner is just normal. Eh. I would say they did give him the dribble package. They did give him the attributes to move and shake. 99, you could put those on 99 real easy. Um, but it left a little bit to be desired. So as we can see, it's a thing. Like when they give them, when they give them the attributes, they're not giving them, as far as these pink diamond and these, uh, these obtainable, opals when they give them the attributes they don't give them the sigs animations when they give them the animations they just don't have the attributes that are actually going to match up but they're obtainable so though at the end of the day you can get your hands on these cards they're readily available they're not what you want but 2k is like take what we give you so that is what it, it is what it is 88 offense 99 defense he's going to be a monster on defense 26 Hall of Fame badges, 20 gold ones. Speed is 97, acceleration 95, 98 vertical. 98, all 98 defense. 95 driving dunk, 95 standing dunk. Can't shoot worth a damn, 25 shot. 25 three point shot, let that sink in. But it's, it is, I mean, come on. 98 offense and defense rebounding. He's gonna be that guy, Ben Wallace. I mean, if you know Ben Wallace worth a damn, then you know he's gonna be that guy in the paint. He's gonna, he got Trey Young escape move. What is his dribbles? 90 speed with ball and 86 ball handle. They gave this man Trey Young escape, Joel B dribble style, Giannis moving crossover. You might be able to get to the rim with bro. 
yeah, he really might be able to get to the rim with this. Ben Wallace might be, you put him on the floor, it's going to be problems. See what this John Starks talking about, just because that's my guy. John Starks is definitely my guy. We got 13 Hall of Fames, 44 gold ones. Uh, this is trash. 95 three-point shot. Eh, I'm not seeing nothing else that's standing out. 86 ball handle. And that's funny. That is funny. If you're still running diamonds in this day and age, though, that's on you, buddy. That is on you, buddy. I don't know how to tell you. I don't know how to tell you. How do I say? You need to get your life together. And I wish I would pull packs for this. I mean, these are these are grindables. This is the reason for me to grind MT. That's really all these rush cards are. If you're using them, but more than that, if you're pulling packs on these rush cards, I feel for you, buddy. I feel for you. I mean, I, I can't say much more about it. The rush players are out. I gave you the tail of the tape. I gave you what you needed. It's up to you to go ahead and go be great. Good luck to you going forward. Like and subscribe and be back here when it's time to be back here. Your booze mean nothing. I've seen what makes you cheer.